For reasons you know, I stand before you in an empty auditorium. Little did I know when I promised you at the October 2019 General Conference that this April conference would be memorable and unforgettable. That speaking to a visible congregation of fewer than 10 people would make this conference so memorable and unforgettable for me. Attendance at this general conference has been strictly limited as part of our efforts to be good global citizens and do all we can to limit the spread of COVID-19. Life's personal trials stretch far beyond this pandemic. Future trials could result from an accident, a natural disaster, or an unexpected personal heartache. How can we endure such trials? The Lord has told us that if ye are prepared, ye shall not fear. Our ultimate quest in life is to prepare to meet our Maker. We do this by striving daily to become more like our Savior, Jesus Christ. This year, we commemorate the 200th anniversary of one of the most significant events in the history of the world, namely, the appearance of God the Father and His beloved Son, Jesus Christ, to Joseph Smith. We are to seek, in every way we can, to hear Jesus Christ, who speaks to us through the power and ministering of the Holy Ghost. The purpose of this and every general conference is to help us to hear Him. The most important lasting effects of this historic conference will be as our hearts change and we commence a lifelong quest to hear Him. Welcome to April 2020 General Conference.